You have entered the Chronix rabbit hole, and everybody, the time has come. Bandmate has made it to the channel. It's coming down the rabbit hole with the song Thrill, and I'm looking forward to this one a lot. Watashi no nama ewa Kyle Desu. Hello, my name is Kyle. It is nice to meet you all. If you are new to the channel, welcome in. We are getting into all these amazing Japanese bands. We started with Baby Metal, then we went to Love Bites. Now we're doing Band Made, and I have found out they that they are a hard rock, all female Japanese band. The singer is Saki, the guitarist is Miku, the lead guitarist is Konami, the bassist is Misa, and the drummer is Akane or a cane and I'm really looking forward to this a lot of the comments from my love bites and ban and baby metal have been suggesting band made so I'm really looking forward to checking this amazing talented band that everyone's talking so highly about and let's get right into it something I found out about this band upon research is that band made is referring to the Japanese maids and cafes and that aesthetic is from that look and so it's a bunch of cafe maids that decided to make their own band. I know there probably weren't cafe maids, but that's kind of the look. I think that's really cool. It's already given me kind of a baby metal vibe with their aesthetics. Um, but I know they can play their own instruments, so it's almost like a blend of Baby Metal and Love Bites together. But let's hear the music itself. I know this is sung in Japanese, but luckily there is um, lyrics in English for subtitles. So I'm excited to continue with whatever they are saying that I can hear. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for being here. Wow, on first listening, this is incredible. I actually really like it. I love that they're singing in Japanese. I love hearing bands sing in their native tongue, um, especially that I can see exactly what they're saying in English and the subtitles. Um, the guitar is really standing out for me right now. It's definitely hard rock. Um, I can see how this is like a middle ground between Love Bites and Bandmaids, and I can see why you guys were pushing me towards this. I'm super thrilled about it. The song itself has some awesome lyrics with it. And let's just keep on going with this. I also love the white background with like the red popping out and the black. Those are all my favorite colors. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, Solo, what? Yeah. 
Oh man, they are so good. I didn't expect to have that incredible solos back to back with that bassist and, and guitarist. Incredible. I love the lyrics just about how all these negative emotions are driving a lot of people right now and to just push it all aside and live in the thrill of sacrificing yourself to greatness and like moving forward and creating um like music like this that creates the joy and like don't let the devil bring you down like it's just awesome to see these type of lyrics as well mixed with this and this was the number one song on their um youtube channel so i went with this one first it has like 19 million views so you can see how popular there are i didn't think they were around this long they've been here since 2013 so i've already missed a decade of them i can't wait to check more of this and let's finish this off <laughs> Regrets is the work of the devil. Don't get scared. Wow, what an introduction to band made. That's incredible. I'm glad I I listened to them first in an official video like that um, because I want to see their whole artistic outlook when they're doing their music as well. And I'm sure when they perform live, they have like uh, an amazing um, stage presence and all that stuff going with it. But it was nice to just see them in the rawness of this white and kind of what they're talking about, like all those regrets that people have. Who cares if you're called a wanderer? Like, I'm leaving. I'm not going to stand, stay here with all these naysayers and these just these bad emotions that people are oozing out. And I'm here for the thrill. And that's why I love these Japanese bands because they're pushing so much encouragement and enthusiasm into me and i'm already goddamn enthusiastic but this type of music itself is what i've been missing it's it's hard rock that i haven't heard in a while and like these these groovy riffs and melodies are just like they're so up my alley and i always think i want something more complex sometimes but honestly it was nice to from just doing love bites to this um, I'm sure they're just as talented, both of these bands, but it was nice to see the difference of the metal and the hard rock and really feel it Japanese style. And because I, I really respect the Japanese culture and what they stand for and what they do in their lifestyle. So I thought it was really cool that it was just about like doing something for yourself and encouraging everyone to not fall for the snares of doubt that the devil gives to everyone and it's just it's, we have the power to beat this adversary if we sacrifice correctly she says she wanted to sacrifice it all and like her all and that's just to what she's moving forward doing like whether it's a reaction channel for me give it my all whether it's being a father give it my all and because if you don't give it your all folks that's when the regrets will seep in and you'll feel like you're you know, your sacrifices aren't being validated. And that's one of the worst feelings that can bring revenge. So this type of a uh, song and band encourages everyone around the world to stay with that thrill. And it, the, the title track is perfect for this. I think it's a perfect introductory to this band. Um, I'm sorry, I don't mean to keep smacking right by the mic there, but that's just how excited I'm getting. And I'm just so happy to find all this amazing talent from Japan. It's the one place I traveled when I was younger that means the world to me. I stayed there for a about a month with a homestay family and traveled all around Tokyo and other cities. 
So I got to learn a bit of their language and I got to learn a bit of their culture there and it changed my life forever. So now that we're full circle doing a reaction channel, now I get to check out all these amazing bands from Japan and especially shout out to all the, the females there. Like it's great to give shine to all the women out there in the world and they're kicking ass and both guitars were incredible. I love seeing um, a bass solo. Like you don't get to see that very often. So I think hard rock sometimes gives it a bit more space to have those bass solos. So that was really cool. I didn't expect that. And I'm sure you guys know what the next best song would be. So this is what we're going to do moving forward. This is my request for you. If you know a song that I should do next, put it down in the comments below. Whoever gets the most upvotes on that song choice with the link... That's the one I'm going to do next. So that's your request in the comments. Put down a song in the song link. Guide me the correct way. I love guitar the most. As you guys can see here, I am a guitarist myself. So that's what I tend to focus on at first. So if you have anything that's amazing shredding, I would obviously love that. I love ballads though. I love really anything. So definitely just guide me to the next best song let me know what the group of bandmade supporters are called like wolf bite i mean wolf pack is for love bites that's an example so if you guys have a name that you have shout it out loud and proud but to finish it off that is me saying i hope to see you again best wishes much respect to you all i hope to see you guys again though we are exiting the rabbit hole folks peace and love god bless y'all don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Enter the Chronicness. Special shout out to all of our patrons and YouTube members. We appreciate all of your support.